Vasily Shovti had been dreaming of the sky since he was a child. He was born to a family of farmers in a small Ukrainian village. With one year to go to the Second World War, the 19-year-old young man entered the Valery Shkalov Borisogleb Aviation Academy. In 1941, he went to the front. His unique tactical literacy and good organizing skills helped him join a military academy to train young pilots. However, he soon received the news about his brother's death, which became a turning point in his life when he asked to be sent to the battlefield. In 1944, Vasily Shovti joined the French Soviet aviation squadron Normandie Nemen. Together with French pilots Vasily Shovti made 19 battle fights. Amongst the numerous battles, the squadron took part in the East Prussia operation and the Konigsberg Fortress. When you are up in the sky and you can see that your enemy is in a more favorable position, you are on the plane and the only thought you have is to eliminate the enemy. This feeling goes up and down your spine. It is an unusual joy as if the whole world tells you to eliminate the enemy, saying get those bad people out of there so they don't spoil the blue sky. I always had a feeling that he is yours and he won't escape anywhere. Vasily Zhovti first learned the news about the victory when he was in Ilding. Six years after the Second World War ended, he was sent to Kazakhstan where he has stayed so far. In 2010, for his service at the Normandy Niemen Squadron, Vasily Zhovti was decorated with the French National Order of the Legion of Honor. For over 30 years now, Vasily Zhovti has worked as the chief of the Aton Aviation Club, which trains pilots and parachutists. He is an excellent teacher. You immediately build trustful relations with him and he is your elder mentor. He is still eager to fly. The 90-year-old military pilot Vasily Zhovti is ready to fly a plane but his health does not allow him to do it. He has been in aviation for over 70 years now. He often dreams of flying again. I dream of the sky. You cannot dream of it. You cannot live without it. The sky always calls you, your soul and heart, so you do not want to stay on earth. If you are a pilot, you will always be called by the sky.